The workday has begun in Rocky Hill, and the excitement builds. On maneuvers today are K-9 Cassis with Officer Todd Mona and K-9 Capo with his partner Juan Rivera. Both Cassis and Capo have earned their stripes as part of the East Hartford Police Department. We have about over 30 successful deployments. That's anything ranging from successful tracks for suspects from stolen cars, from burglaries, to uh, missing children. Break. He, he saved me from probably being in a gunfight. He took down a guy with a gun. Alongside canine officers from across the state. So I really need him here. Training like this. So the canine come out now, the dog, you'll be bit. This was a, a real scenario. This is how we train real life. Shut your mouth, get him. It's what we need to do in order to stay safe. Has prepared Cassis and Capo for an even bigger stage. It's pretty wild that they reached out to us and they found us and they asked us to participate. That's a good doggy. It's kind of cool. I never expected that an opportunity would come our way like this. From East Hartford to Hollywood. Who's a good boy? Oh boy, here we go. A chance to become America's top dog. America's Top Dog is a combination of American Ninja Warrior and Live PD. Welcome to the ultimate canine competition. Fast pace, a lot of moving parts, pretty wild experience. Reality TV has gone to the canines. First is the canine combine, testing speed and agility. It's a sort of parkour on all fours. They're like, all right, one, two, three, go, you're up. And then you start going through it. Good boy. We're the only ones from Connecticut, so we kind of had some weight on our shoulders going out there. Good, good. We prepared as best as we could. Both Cassis and Capo's episodes will premiere later this month. Come on out, you're gonna get bit! And from California, now back home in Connecticut. Their partners say this experience has built an even stronger bond. You don't have much time to prep, but it, you know, we push the dog's threshold. It's something new and from there, you just build a better dog. Oh, good boy, what you got? I'm very proud of him. Good boy. He surprised me, and definitely in a good way. So it was a lot. It was a lot of fun. That's <laughs> a good boy. Who's a good doggy? In Rocky Hill. Who's a good boy? Who's a good doggy? Who's a good doggy? Jim Altman, Fox 61 News. They're absolutely both good boys, and you will see them in action soon. Juan and Capo's episode airs next Wednesday night on a &E. and Todd and Cassis, they should air later, sometime later in February. Very athletic. I think a lot of people yes. are going to like watching that because, you know, we all love dogs. Of course. And they, they, I'm sure they do some amazing things. Now, this has already been taped, right? It's already been taped, but right. we are sworn to secrecy. We say, don't give know. Us a little inside information. I don't, I don't know, we're, we're, but I, I will tell you this. They did us proud. They told they told me they did us proud. And you know, Todd is one of the great trainers of, uh -huh. of Connecticut. He trains a lot of canines. So good hands and, and they are representing. Love it. Great story, Jimmy. Right. Looking forward Thanks, to guys. seeing that.